in my position, I had been out of the, I'd been working, you know, at home with our own business. So it was quite scary to jump into, uh, especially at my age, I'm 56 years old. So to jump into something brand new to me was really scary. But when I walked into the, to the office and I met my manager and she was so, I mean, she sold me on the job. She's a great manager. We get along really good and she really tries to, um, to make the office a cohesive place. So she works with us. She's, um, she makes it easy if we need to use our PTO. It's easy to use that when we need to or just want to. You know, it's, it's, it makes it, she makes it easy for us to do that. I think community offers a pretty good um, benefit package. In fact, when I came to work for community, I was, like I said, we were self-employed. So I thought the insurance is really one of my top priorities, you know, but I fell in love with everything else. The insurance was a bonus by the time I got to the office. The PTO hours, I think they do well with the amount that we, that, that they give us, um, especially in my case with my son at home, you know, I thought, oh gosh, am I going to have enough time, you know, to be able to take care of him too. And it hasn't been an issue. Like I said, I've been there a year and we haven't, we haven't run into an issue where I haven't had the time to do so. I can think of uh, one one instance where we have a young mom in the office, brand new baby, and she's struggling financially. She might be struggling, she was struggling financially and getting the care, the items or whatever she needed for her new baby. And you know, we could see that she was struggling. And without her actually asking for help, we were able to say, hey, do you need some help? You know, we, we could offer you a Walmart gift card to go get, you know, go get supplies for your baby or whatever and I think that that um, that made me feel like that's what we're here for you know we're here to make sure that their health care needs are met but also if they can't get to the doctor to have their health care needs met then, then, then we've lost them so I think just by being able to to help them out and offer them supplies a transportation to get there is is a big one <laughs>